welcome back. Here is how to import and edit your audio. First, we're going to go into the project panel and choose our audio file. And I'm going to choose the song Gloom Horizon. That seems appropriate for this time of year. And if you would like to see a little bit more of your audio, you can use this little scrubbing bar right here to increase your view and then you can see the waveforms more clearly. Uh, so let's see, uh, perhaps I'd like to do a little bit of a fade in here. So what I'm going to do is go to my effects panel, choose something called constant power under the audio transitions, click and hold, and then I can right click, set the duration. I'm going to set that to three seconds. And then we have a fade in. Let's see what that sounds like. That sounds pretty good. I'm going to press stop by using the space bar. And I'm going to use my arrow buttons as another shortcut to go to the last edit point. The down arrow button can be used to advance and the up arrow button can be used to rewind. And right here is where I'd like to make my cut. I'm going to use the razor tool, cut that, select, select the portion that I do not wish to use, and delete that. And maybe I'd like to put a little bit of a fade out here. I will go back into my effects panel, choose constant power, and then I will set the duration another three seconds and that is a quick and easy way to fade in and fade out your video. The other thing you can do is add keyframes. So let's say there's a certain point at which I would like the music to go down in volume because there's some dialogue. You can insert some keyframes and to find those can just scrub up a little bit here. These diamond shapes right here, these are called keyframes. So you can just place your playhead where you would like to have the keyframe. Click. Let's put one here. And then we can put one here. So you can take any one of these points and drag it up or down to make your audio increase or decrease. And those are two really simple ways to edit your audio. Have fun.